Hi guys, it's Ben here at Liverpool, just beating Southampton 3-0, and I think, you know, even though this isn't necessarily an impressive win in terms of the opposition, and the scoreline's pretty par, I suppose, for, for, for the outside looking in, this is probably the happiest I've been all season, even happier than the 4-0 against Arsenal. This, oh, we're just winning games that we should win, that's three Premier League wins on the bounce, I didn't expect us to do that, I know that it was essential that we did if we were going to, you know, stay in that sort of race for the top four, or, or in sort of in and around those teams that are doing well, we just beat Southampton 3-0 at home. We, we always struggle against them. Uh, we scored relatively early on in terms of the first half. Obviously, we didn't do that against um, Huddersfield at home nor Maribor. So, to go in at halftime 2-0 up with two Salah goals, we've got a real 20-goal a man, 20-goal a season man, sorry, in Mo Salah. I'm just delighted in what's happened today. It was so routine. It was so easy. No one even had to play that well. It was just, we're so much better than them. They knew that. We knew that. And we're looking like a team. We've got more options. We've got Mane firing, Salah firing, Coutinho scoring again today. The defence was pretty makeshift, but they had no issues. It, you know, I thought Trent Alexander-Arnold was absolutely superb at the back. Meaning they didn't have a save to make. Lovren and Clavin were fine. Moreno was good. Oh, that was just lovely. And we had so much to come off the bench as well. We had Emre Chan to bring on. Oxo Chomin to come on. Um, didn't even need to bring Sturridge on. Milner did come on. We've still got the Lions to come back in. <sighs> I'm smiling. I'm smiling for the first time this season. I really am. This is a good place to, to be in. Um, look, City are going to run away with the title. I think the title race, as far as I'm concerned, is over. Um, which just sounds ridiculous in, in, in November, but I just can't see them dropping any points. They're, they're a level above, and they should be. They spent all that money, and you know, it's about time it came together for them. But we're in a, we're in a decent place. Um, a lot of teams are doing well. Chelsea won four 0 today. Uh, Arsenal did well against Spurs. Um, but we're right up in there, we're, we're beating teams that we should, 3-0 there. I'm going to be very interested in the Chelsea game next week. Let's get into player ratings. Um, all very positive. Mignolet had nothing to do. Um, you know, one punch in the first half, I think. But, I mean, I'll give him a seven just for keeping it keeping it relatively calm back there. Did that one little Cruyff turn at the back, which always panicked me, but fair enough. Trent, I thought, was absolutely brilliant. I'm going to give him an eight out of ten. Uh, didn't put a foot wrong, particularly in the first half. Bertrand was really trying it on, but just to no avail. Buffal as well. Um, just thought he was great. Got forward brilliantly. I was surprised Gomez didn't play today. I thought he might have played a right back or even a centre back. Um, but absolutely fine for, for, for Trent. Uh, Lovren, stupid tackle on Van Dyke to get a yellow card. Maybe he doesn't like Virgil. Um, 6 out of 10. Clavin, 7. Same performance as Lovren, but without the stupid yellow card. Uh, Moreno, 7. Fine. Got forward well. Crossing wasn't ideal, but. Um, got that a couple of chances. Midfield, it was just very easy for them. I thought Henderson and, and Van Alden controlled it relatively well. I, I guess I'll give them seven apiece. I think maybe Van Alden edged it slightly out of the two. Um, Henderson was a bit wasteful uh, in the first half an hour or so. Um, Coutinho ha didn't have to be that good, but he used the ball well, got gets his goal. Uh, I'll give him an eight. Uh, Sadio Mane, um, overshadowed by the guy on the other wing, but Still lively, uh, I still give him an 8 out of 10. Uh, Firmino dropped deep, tried to get involved, never really looked like scoring, which is a bit of concern with him at the moment. His goal record isn't what you want from a striker, but I suppose you know he, he helps out the, the guys outside of him so much, it's not as much of a concern. Um, 7 out of 10. Salah is the best player in the league at the moment. Um, best signing of the summer, the league's top scorer, the bargain of the summer, you run out of superlatives, there's nothing bad to say about this guy, works his arse off, his, his finishing's getting a lot better, takes his chances, the second one was arguably more pleasing than the first one, it was a one-on-one, -on -one, which, you know, he's not always been comfortable in those situations uh, this season, but lovely composed finish, a finish of a man who's got double figures already uh, before Christmas, um, so impressed, the first goal was gorgeous as well, I'm just going to give him a 10, because... I just love him. Uh, substitutes, Emre Chan, six, Milner, six. Am I going to even remember who? Oh, it's like Chamberlain, six, yeah. But just so happy. Uh, we go to Seville midweek. Let's see how we can get on out there. If we can win out there, which I wouldn't rule us out of doing and kind of probably secure the uh, passage into the last 16, then it's Chelsea. And then, you know, two, two games in a week in the league. Uh, you know, Chelsea at home, Stoke away, tough games. But look, we're in good form. I know Chelsea are as well. It's going to be a great game at Anfield next Saturday tea time. I'm going to be there. Looking forward to it. And then Stoke away. Uh, and then I believe we got Brighton away. So look, still we can rack up some serious points in the build up to Christmas before that Arsenal away game, which is the next really tough one um, after Chelsea. So buzzing, excited, happy for the first time really in a long time. Uh, I know I've wrote off the season and it is over as far as the title is concerned, but 
we're doing as much as we can to stay in touch with, with, with that sort of pack, the top six. So delighted, get in, up the reds. Thank you very much. See you next time.